No, 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 I'm good. I'm good, bro. I heard a fucking noise back here. I swear to God that that's her. The head lady. Stoop. Give me that stool coin. Give me the damn coin. I want the coin. Thank you. There's still a flower here left somewhere. Oh, how nice! Tur surely she's not going to be there while I turn around! Oh, look at that! Hi, friend! <laughs> Try me, bitch. Fuck. Don't do that. No. Do not do that. No. 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 Well, fuck you too. <sighs> Turns off the lights. <sighs> Turns off the damn lights and lets me go all the way back there for turning back on. Don't do that to me. Let's do this. Oh, hello. What the hell are you doing? Weird looking tree. Why did this just open a moment ago? She just opened this. Why did it close again? Oh, hey! Oh. I've seen you. Yes, you have. What are you doing here at this hour? I wanted to return your diary. So you had it then? Yeah, you left out the bench. You bench. came here just to do that? Well, yeah. Yeah, I saw Gion too. Jihyeon is here too? What? Oh! And here we go! Boss fight time, guys! He dropped something. Alright, here we go. Go time. We run as fast as we want it here, because the janitor won't shut up. Uh, we go to the hiking club. This is the hiking club? Where is it? Is it? This is it. Purchase request slip. Request instant propellant spray. Reason to prevent damage caused by insects while participating in outdoor activities. Warning keep away from heat in open flame as the content is extremely flammable. Give me that shit. I need that. Burn some shit. Oh, there's a mercy help. There's a mercy kit here. How did I miss this my first playthrough? Uh. 
Uh, we'll read this later. I have to look up how. Remember, left then right, right then left, A6, A3, 94, 96. Shit, that's different the last time. I had it written down a on the last time. Of course they change up the puzzles every playthrough. We <laughs> still Combination thing is insane. No, do not wear a hat when seen a school nurse. I think she hates hats. Well, she's biased. Uh, E6. Is it the same number of medals though? Four, two, eight, three, nine, six. Yeah. Oh, we had six minutes. That's I think that's less. That's less time than I had in the action the easy mode. Of course it is. All right. So it's the same number of medals, but the, the order is different. Five, nine, two, four. Five, nine, two, four. Alright. So first we gotta go left. Five, nine, That's wrong. Five, nine, two, four. Got it. Give me that shit. Come and solve it. Got it. Alright, what next? Notebook out of the way. Right. Yeah, guys, remember those weird looking trees? Well, yeah. They're not weird looking trees. This is the ghost tree we read story we read earlier. We gotta go around and destroy these trees. Why am I turning these on? Well Because I can't. Probably the only chance we got to do it. Oh, right here. All right, we got hurt. We got five minutes. I think there are five of these things. This one.
Yeah, that's a... That's a tree. Let's see how quick. Let's go time, guys. Took care of the plants. Now the big tree is next. Next, motherfucker. Over. Alright guys, this is our opportunity to freely roam the school, Let's freely roam the building, still taking off the damn headphones just in case the motherfucker shows up, but the janitor will not show up whatsoever. We are free to do whatever the hell we want, turn on, turn on all the damn lights. Chickens. This is mine now. Don't know why I need it, but it's mine. There's something shiny in there. Uh, it's now mine. I'll take that. Give me that. I can save. Some. Charlie is laying at my feet. This is like the only chance we've got to go look around for items about Jander, Dickhead, trying to beat our head in. Oh yeah, it's lucky lunchbox. This is a really good health item, guys. I'm gonna try backing up, see if there's anything shiny in lockers. Does not look like there is. Something shiny in that locker. What's 
think there's a radio somewhere. Let's get up. Is there a nice classroom over? That's weird. Selling all of our math of your own mathematics schedules. Let's go from there, what the hell? Oh. Another shiny over there. I am in here. Report cards, second class. We'll need this one for ghosts. I can open this now actually. Yay! Shortcut! Just a nice little jog around school, you know. I'll piss off the janitor when he spawns back in. He's gonna have to go around like turning off all of these damn lights. Fuck that guy. That's where we go. That thing. Wait. Oh shit, are we supposed to put those here? Oh! Oh, we're supposed to put those here! I was just been picking them up on my first playthrough. I didn't know we had an actual place where you're supposed to put them. Fuck, this is another area we need to go for a ghost. We get the gym to do that. That's something we need to do. Uh, uh, uh. That, I hate this. Like that's something we definitely need to do before we end off the episode or go to the next area. Let's just look for those other ghost sightings for the collection. One, see these handprints. We have to look directly at these. It's the love letter. Uh, so I know of three. I know of three we have to do. One of them is in the locker when the lights are off. Another is. And there is that attendance one we need a gym teacher's hat. We need to look in one of these lockers and the fucking the lady in the closet comes out. Smacks us upside the head. This door can't be used from this side. Oh fuck, I think this is the other ghost area. The math book and chalk. The lights are off in this room. Alright. We've gotten all the items. Let's see something on here. We might come back to this area later, but um, oh, another ghost story, guys. Voice that beckons me. A and B were very close classmates. A w A always took care of B, who was very fragile. B was always thankful to A for that. Well, A, 
we knew that knew it would be impossible to have a school, have a normal school life. To be A was the most important person in the world. Then one day there was an accident at the school. There was a fire in the old school building. Now, unfortunately, B was inside. B cannot escape and died in the fire. A was deeply saddened by B's death. She could almost hear B screaming out his name, begging to be saved. In the imagination of A, the desperate voice calling out for help from B slowly filled with resentment. A felt very sad and thought that B's death was her fault. After that, A did not st step outside her room. A's mind was full of thoughts of B. Even while asleep, B would appear in, a, in the dream of A, resenting A for not being able to save B. Being awake was no different. The voice... The voice of B always followed A. A knew it must not must be an auditory hallucination created by her sadness and guilt. A was in agony nonetheless. A began to lose weight day by day, suffering from the pain and guilt. Then one night, A quietly snuck out of her room to visit the school. A passed by the bench in the school field where they always sat and chatted with each other. They arrived at the spot where B died. A heard the resentful voice of B even there. A thought it was time to end her agony, to escape the sadness of guilt of losing the friend she loved. A chose suicide. A thought that, go that going to where B was now uh, would be the only way to escape from the haunting voice of B. A chose to hang herself. The pain was so great that A couldn't breathe until her sight slowly faded away. As if coming to greet A, the face of B appeared faintly in front of her. The face of B, glowing with a hazy blue light, smiling brightly. B's face came closer and whispered, Thanks, I need you to die significant. A struggled to breathe, to save herself from her fate. The voice that just whispered was the voice of B. The same voice that had been following A ever since B died. A wasn't hearing things. The voice was real. <laughs> slam the lock! <laughs> just slams the locker shut. I can't get over how comedic that is. Just aggressively slams it shut. Alright, so we need to grab this to progress. The second I do, I'm running down that fucking hallway and saving the game. We're going to save. We're going to save the ghosts for next episode. You know what? Fuck it. I'll give you guys one. I'll give you one ghost reveal before this episode ends, because it's right down the hall from here, and we've got the required items to trigger it. First. Wooden token. Time for Janet to come back. That's not the hall. That's not the door I exited out of. Hey, why are you still here? Anyway, what was that noise I heard? A big tree monster kidnapped so young. Tree? Are you insane? understand what you're saying. Why are there so many guys in this school who are completely obsessed with So Young? She's not even that pretty. Once again, bitchy personality. <clears throat> hey, come on, be honest. Are you here this late because you're into So Young as well? Is it? Because tomorrow is White Day. That's enough of your business. Uh, 
Have it your way, then. Look, wake up, stupid. You think you're the only one so young bewitched with that face of hers? You don't know this, but she's a manipulative witch. Pretty sure that better describes you. I think you're being rather rude. Are you taking her side? No, I just don't trust your ass. And that's not all. There are a ton of totally strange rumors about her. Rumor has it, so young. Huh? Did you hear something just now? Ah! Where the sound was coming from? Oh, I think you can already tell. Hello, friend. Oh, hey. What are you doing in here? Tell me, what happened earlier? Are you alright? Are you hurt? Yeah, I'm fine. I can't remember anything. I woke up on the floor of a completely different room. I have a feeling that tonight is very different. Well, no shit! Maybe the day is here. You know something too, don't you? There was this piece of wood that looked like a talisman. All I did was put it in place. Oh yeah? Uh, maybe. That might have caused it. All right, that's fine. That's fine. This is a wicked ancient evil. No big deal. This school has so many hidden secrets. I'm gonna go now. If you want to leave the school, go to main building too. Yep. Let's get the hell out of here before you know who shows up. You know he's already active. I hear him. I hear him already. I'm gonna save the game. I'm going to give you guys one ghost reveal before we head to the main building too in the episode. I swear to god you guys are talking. We got four felt tilt pens, that's, that's pretty good. That's pretty good for saving. So it's supposed to happen right about here. Got the love letter. Get to stare at it. Hi, friends. Hi. Hi. Okay, bye. Have a beautiful time. He's here, isn't he? Let's get to main building too. Get the hell out of here. Well, we'll save we'll save the other ghosts for another episode. <laughs> Cause I'm uh, my limit. <laughs> I'm sure this looks no this looks like nothing to you guys, but you're not the one playing the game right now. <laughs> I'm sure I just look a I look, just look like a huge wimp this whole episode. Alright, I don't see... I don't see him. I don't see him. I think... I think he might have gone this way. Or he might not be on this floor. Oh, we'd be so fucking lucky. Right, I don't see our janitor. Wait. 
No, that's not him. I think this is what's classroom with the one that's supposed to appear, but I'll save that for another episode. I'll put the headphones on for this once so I don't run into him. You can listen to his fucking keys. Locked it. Go. Get the fuck out of this building. All right. I tried to turn it into an art school, but it wasn't really successful. Gee, I wonder why. Couldn't have anything to do with all the ghosts. I have to find a way to get to the new building. Auto saving or I think we have to do the back of the office. If I remember correctly. Oh! Hello! Hello. Hey, how you doing little guy? Say hello. Rude. I just want to say hello and you scream in my ear. Pin. I don't know why that how that would ever be useful. Hello. Hello. <laughs> Sorry, wrong number! <laughs> Faculty notice. Attention! In all teachers working night shifts, the passcode to the principal office has been changed due to the recent leak in the previous passcode. Passcode is on the chalkboard in the student the department office, written with a special piece of chalk that is invisible under fluorescent light. The principal is not approved of other is entering his office while he's away. Please use the passcode only in, in cases of emergencies or special circumstances. Vice Principal Sang Mu Lee of Yeondu High School. Note to the gym teacher. Please make sure you return the student department key, key department office key when your shift is over. You have a bad you have a habit of leaving the key in your gym pocket it, making it difficult for the next shift to take over. Other faculty members are also advised to turn the key turn the key after the shift is over. I think there might be something in the principal's office. Oh, you can go to the counselor's office, right, I forgot. Mental health of students. That means student. Blah, blah. That's completely cut off. I 
Is there a point to any of these doors? There's almost never anything in them. One of the ghosts. That's another ghost, guys. The lying female students. Hello, oh, friend. Are you okay? Alright, fuck you too. Goodbye. Just wanted to check on you. Lost and found. fan art. I don't know if this is what actually I think most of these might be developers. I think like I like I like how they hit stuff in there like this. I wonder if this is like the development team right here. Or something. I like that little dude stuff. So you know we want We have to. We're probably even too busy running over our lives to pay this game. I think this basically just talks about. Yeah, it basically talks about what we already were warned of. Probably talking about the coffee. Coffee refills your health, but it decreases your stamina. Whatever the point of this is, though. I don't know of any puzzles relating to it. You guys got any idea? Let me know in the comments below. I don't think I ever encountered anything before that. Alright, well, these things about the like, paper cranes we keep picking up. I, I remember, like, in the new building, we passed, like, an area where there were a bunch of paper cranes. That's probably where, the, how, where it's supposed to be used for. Like, the mathematics. Like, the little mathematics blocks. I was picking those up before, but I didn't know what they were used for until then. Alright, so this is the student department key office. What? I think I might end the episode here, guys. Felt tip coming up, definitely a good place to stop. So no over here. Cult club announcement. A pet announcement from the occult club. With the, new, with the start of the new term, we've prepared an event for everyone. We will give out a small prize for anyone who can solve the qu this quiz and bring the hidden truth, the hidden treasure to our club. The treasure is sleeping under a place covered by the dust of the erased knowledge. Because out there, the treasure is sleeping in the place covered by the dust of race knowledge and can only be woken by the hand that handshakes every day. The hidden treasure is a clue to one of the latest ghost stories piece of the school that's quickly gaining fame. Whoever finds it, it first can have it. No one has been able to collect the full series so far and therefore is a high commodity collectible among students. 
This is a great opportunity to get both the clue for the latest ghost story and a handsome prize. We hope all of you participate. Yes, if by any chance you collect all the clues this is the ghost stories in this event, please contact the president of the occult club. Alright guys, I'm saving it here. Alright. Alright everyone. No, this is just that. Alright everyone. Running off the episode here. Yeah, I'm, I'm literally just. <laughs> I'm literally stopping like this. We're going to end off the episode here. Leave a like if you guys enjoyed. Subscribe. Me all that stuff. I will see you guys in the next episode. Later!